You're getting a first look at City Creek Mall in downtown Salt Lake City. The fountain right behind me was just put in a couple weeks ago. We want to thank Clark Planetarium for letting us come out and visit today. If you'd like to go stargazing at 4th be... South and 2nd East, where police are cracking down on riders who are not paying And their... stay tuned to ABC4 for continuing coverage of the Royal Wedding. Friday morning coverage begins at 2 a.m., the wedding is at 4 a.m., and you can also watch streaming video of it all on ABC. I'm here at Hogel Zoo standing in front of the Megalosaurus. It's one of 13 animatronic dinosaurs on display this summer. Bill number HB 477 went to committee, then straight to the Senate floor and passed within one hour. We're here at Clark Planetarium where it looks like the kids are having fun. Are you guys having fun? Yeah! yeah! Morales, who is Miss Utah Latina, and she is about to go to the Dominican Republic. Tonight we've spoken to many shop owners at Gateway Mall. Who if you look right behind me, you can see just how dangerously fast the river is going right now. To the right of me is a playground where kids come to play every day. Coming up on ABC 4 News at 9 on CW30, how a bill designed to bring more money to Utah's school children is falling short. Dorm room. And, and I'll let you know how much the dollar is really worth. The Utah basketball team has made 27 tournament appearances and has played in Utah once. We're here at the state capitol where the Senate just passed a law that parents are no longer allowed to leave their children unattended in a car. Free stargazing. Everyone's welcome to come and they will take two telescopes on the roof. From the IMAX Theater in downtown Salt Lake City, this is Alexis Scott, ABC4 News. Here from the Salt Lake State Capitol, this is Alexis Scott, ABC4 News. From the newest mall in Salt Lake City, Utah, this is Alexis Scott, ABC4 News. Reporting from the track station in downtown Salt Lake City, this is Alexis Scott, ABC4 News.